My name is Jay Wilson, and I'm going to give you three things that I do not use in my aquarium filtration anymore, and why. What is that? What's going on everybody? It's Jay Wilson and I told you I'd talk about some things that I no longer use in my aquarium and why. So one of the things I no longer use is phosphate pads. I tried it because I was having some problems with what I thought was phosphates after the tests I'd done and well, the phosphate pads I was using didn't really work. So I used Seachem Fosgard. That worked, ridded my problem, I corrected the situation, now I'm good. I no longer use those. Way back in the day, I used to use Melafix and Pimafix. I will no longer ever use this chemical in any way, shape, or form for anything for my aquarium fish based upon the research I've done over the years. And there's a reason. It's just mainly tea tree oil. And in abundance can actually become toxic to certain fish. Now, you're gonna laugh at this because I promoted heavily Seachem Purigen. While I love the product, I no longer use it because of Boyd Enterprises Chemi Pure Blue. Chemi Pure Blue is simply phenomenal. It has the Purigen-like resin inside, however non-rechargeable, and it has like this super duty carbon. It is a phenomenal product and will make any tank crystal clear. Some of the key products that I still use are Chemi Pure Blue, Pinky's Filters, Polyfill, and C Chem's Pond Matrix or Matrix. To me, it is a far superior biological filtration media. Now, some other things I no longer use, salt of any way, shape, or form. I haven't used it in a while because I didn't have any and never purchased it, and that's been probably a year now, and I no longer use it. I actually first started in my Lake Tanganyika and Trophius tank that I had, the Trophius Mori Kasenga, if you remember, I was using that buffer. I no longer use it anymore, I no longer have those fish, and I no longer use aquarium salt for any of the other tanks that I use, except this one, because it has salt in it. You get the point. I appreciate you watching, I hope you learned a little bit. Thank you so much for subscribing, liking, sharing, tweeting, retweeting, double tapping, liking, doing everything you do to make this channel relevant. If you noticed in the past, we've been doing some really cool things with Sunday's videos, Wednesday's sub up of the week and some fish room tours, Friday's live video, and hopefully some stuff you find along social media. If you get a chance, check out northvinusa.com and give us a follow on Facebook and Instagram. You know what's next. Aha! Yes, I see you stayed a little longer here. Maybe you should hit the sub button and the bell and you'll get notified on my sweet videos, huh? Pretty cool. Everybody's doing it. I'm serious. Hit the sub button and the bell. I'm telling you. It's life changing.